Hello, so today we are unboxing the spontaneous pop-up display from the company Arovia. Arovia was in the first cohort of the Luminate Accelerator program, and uh, this is their first product. And I haven't seen it yet. The idea of the pop-up display is that uh, it's a portable display that uh, pops up. So the first thing we've got in here is a quick start guide, which I'm going to probably try to not use. Um, we have a signed letter, uh, which is good. Um, the day is here. You are one of the first people ever to have a spud, spontaneous pop-up display. Uh, we can read all that later, but they like us. OK. the. Next thing, so this is the actual device here. Uh, we've got that, and we've got let's see. Ooh, all sorts of things. OK. Uh, we have HDMI cable. We have. USB-C, and uh, there we go, power. Even without uh, instructions, I can handle that. Uh, USB-C port for power, so that's nice these days. If storing more than 24 hours, keep arms in the extended position to help mitigate screen wrinkles. It's also not a toy. <clears throat> it all comes bound into this uh, hook size shape here. Maybe I actually do need to quickly look at an instruction to see how to pop this open. It can't be too complicated. OK, so we unfold it so we can see Erovia on the top. Um, I grasp the handle. Uh, with the Aerovia text. Uh, let's get this out of the way. And not break anything. Um, tip just like an umbrella. Lightly shaking spud to loosen the retractable arms makes popping up easier. So I can feel that it wants to do something here. There it goes. <laughs> I'm sure that someone more skilled will be able to do this automatically. There we go. Uh, we have, this is light. So there's the Aerovia logo. Uh, on the back here, we've got all of the requirements. Now, I set up USB and HDMI. We will try to hook that up. First thing is, Let's give it some power. Okay. USB C to charge. Oh, it charges. Okay, that's neat. So it must have a battery inside. And I'm pretty sure that the next thing 
uh, oh, let's see how do we close it. Um, use one hand to grasp the handle. Uh, and did this show up something, by the way? Not yet. <coughs> So pull the slider. Ooh, there we go. Okay. Collapsing. Easy enough. That was not hard. Watch your fingers. Okay. So hopefully I hook this up to something with the right amount of power. And push the power button. Let's see. Press and hold. Ah. Oh, I can hear it. Okay. It has built-in speakers. And it does have a battery charge. Okay. Neat. And it, it does work like a, like a rear projector. This stuff moves, but that holds still. Uh, connect HDMI. Oh, here a fan kick in. And then I may need to wake this up. There we go. OK, so that's a video for it actually playing. Adjust the volume. I was traveling, working not only overseas, but at different parts of my home, different parts of my office. And I realized there's this gap in the market between the large displays that we need and the brightness. We're the first ones to crack the code of how you can have a display that's large and portable. Okay. We'll let him do a commercial some other time. There we go. Okay. Now let me see how to package this back up into. So I assume first power it down. Okay. Well. Okay, there we go there. And are there any tricks here? I think so. Oh, it says adjust brightness and focus. The focus was already really good. Um, and let's just try to close this back up. They recommend Oh, this actually seems to go smaller. Word and down. Okay. And the screen to the back or front away from the top edge. There's those as well. They say I guess I want to show the Aerovia logo. Pull that underneath. I'm 
probably do that neater, but there we go. Spontaneous pop-up display from Orovia. Book-sized if you like the Bible. Thank you.